Today we're going to discuss a free learning tool, ADAPT version 10 installation with its prerequisites. Google ADAPT. In the welcome page, we can see that ADAPT is a free and easy to use e-learning authoring tool that creates fully responsive and multi-device HTML5 e-learning content using the ADAPT developer framework. Click get started. We have two options. The ADAPT authoring tool is intended to be installed on a publicly accessible web server if you want developer option or you could just install it on a personal computer for individual use as creator. This is the screen we'll be having after we successfully install ADAPT version 10. At the bottom, click Get Details on GitHub. We're going to install the stable version which is 10.0. ADAPT is a global open source e-learning project aiming to bring industry-leading content creation tools. Click ADAPT authoring and we download the code. We extract the files at the home directory. This is our content. Git is a tool for managing source code and makes downloads and updates the authoring tool code base easier. In terminal, enter the command line. Install git all. Then configure git globally with user.name and user.email. sudo app install github. Provide the root password. We check the git version we installed. It's 2.28. Configure the username. Then configure your email address. Node.js provides the JavaScript engine to run the authoring tool application and handles the installation and updating of the tool's dependencies via the Node Package Manager. We download Node.js binary archive and then unzip, navigate to its directory, open a terminal, enter the commands, make directory, then we use the tar utility command to extract the tar package file to our local directory. Google the Node.js website and download the latest stable release, 12.18.3. We'll right-click the file, open in terminal. Then we make the directory. Issue the root password. Then we use the tar utility command to extract our binary archive file. We need to set our environment variable that profile. We add the following text at the bottom. Then we need to refresh the profile by issuing the command dot tilde slash dot profile. Verify Node.js installation by checking their version. We have the latest Node version 12.18.3 and the FPX 6.14.6. Grunt is a task runner which handles all the necessary actions required to build the course. Using the node package manager in terminal to enter the command, install grant command line interface, we install grant country js here, install grant CLI, check the grant version. We have the latest 1.2.0 and the CLI version 1.3.2. Install Grant. And then the JavaScript in. MongoDB is a general purpose document based distributed database built for modern application developers for the cloud era. First, we import MongoDB package key by running the given code at the terminal. OK means we have the key. Now create a list file for MongoDB by issuing the command below. We can see that list at etc slash apt slash sources dot list dot d. Then we reload the local package database by sudo apt-get update, installing the MongoDB packages by apt-get install mongodb-org.
though optional, but it's good that we hold the MongoDB files to protect them if ever we update or we upgrade our system. So we hold the server, the shell, mongos, and tools. We check our platform's init system by running ps. Based on the output, we could start MongoDB. In our case, it's system control start MongoD. Then begin using MongoDB by issuing the command mongo. We got systemd. Checking mongo status is now active and running. We have the latest version of Mongo, version 4.4. Now we install Adapt eLearning tool version 10. We navigate to Adapt authoring tool folder we downloaded earlier and issue the command npm install production. Run script to install and configure the new authoring tool. Then we can start the authoring tool Node.js application by issuing the command Node server. Go to our Adapt folder, we right click, open in terminal, install it in production. We need to run the audit fix for the vulnerables. Run audit fix force for more vulnerables. We install node, enter Y. As suggested, just press enter to accept the default value in brackets. Here, you will enter your user account and provide password. Installation is complete. We could run node server. And it's listening at port 5000. Lastly, to run our Adapt eLearning tool version 10, we go to our web browser and type localhost colon 5000. Provide your user account and the password you entered. And we have the eLearning tool Adapt version 10 welcome screen. That's it. Thank you. Please subscribe, share, and click that notification button for our next lectures.